Hi, I'm James, and I'd like first of all to thank uh, YouTube user K543 for this. Um, with some of the issues I'd had in FIFA, he pointed out that there was actually a later driver available for KB Lake and Sky Lake through Windows Update. Um, so what we have here is the website laptopvideotogo.com, and in their forums they have a download for the 4526 driver. Um, the laptop itself came with 4492 and Windows Update doesn't actually push out this driver to it, uh, the 4526, but through this website you can download it and install it. So what I've done is I've gone ahead and already done this on this particular machine. So there is a download link for a CAB file and I'll put the link in the description below. And by downloading that, we get this file here. Now, it doesn't have an actual installer, but what we need to do is go into it. We want to select all and copy the contents. And then I've just created a folder here, and I've already pasted it in. It does take a little while to extract. Uh, it took about 10, 15 minutes for me. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to select the folder where it is and copy that. And like I say, there's no installer as such in this particular, you know, we've not got a setup file. So what we need to do is if we go to Device Manager, Display Adapters, HD Graphics 620, and we can see in the driver version here we have 4492. Now this is actually already going to show the new driver in here because I've installed it before. But what I need to do is say, let me pick from a list of device drivers on my computer. If we do it with this browse, it won't pick it up. It'll say it's going to keep using the old one. We want to say have disk, paste in the new directory here, and say OK, and that will pick up the new driver for HD 620. Um, if you want to have a look at what else is included in there, we have drivers for 630, 635, and also some Skylake drivers. Uh, Skylake Intel do have some newer ones already available, but they don't have any KB Link drive KB Lake drivers on their website just yet. So we are going to say show compatible hardware, select next, and that will run through and install the driver. And this actually is in just the first couple of games that I've tested has um, actually fixed a couple issues that I noticed in those. One of which was just a minor visual issue in GTA 5. The other which was actually something game breaking in FIFA 2017. So we're just going to take a look at those now. And we can see now we have the updated driver installed. First of all, if we take a look at FIFA 2017, we can see to the left behind the edge of the pitch, there is some weird colored banding, um, which is a graphical artifact that is consistent whilst we were playing the game on the earlier 4492 drive. And we can also see that here um, behind the goal in the bottom right, we also have that weird graphical effect there. And even more serious than that, you got, as we can see here, this rapid flashing, um, which basically rendered the game unplayable. This wouldn't always happen immediately, but when it did, you basically just had to abort the match and start over. By contrast, if we take a look at testing the game with the later 4592 drivers, you can see there's no artifacting at the side of the pitch, and also, after playing through a few games, at no point did I experience that rapid flashing which just rendered the game completely unplayable. Looking at GTA 5, and as you can see here in this scene from the benchmark, the top of the riverbed appears dry. Um, as it does actually on some previous generations of Intel HD, uh, particularly um, Broadwell and Sky Lake I noticed it on. Whereas if we look with the 4592 driver, the water is actually rendering correctly all the way through this scene now. So, so if you have a KB Lake or even some of the earlier Intel graphics uh, adapters, I'd look at updating to these latest drivers. Uh, like I say, links in the description below for KB Lake and Sky Lake drivers. Uh, older ones you can get from the Intel website. I hope you found this video useful and be sure to check out our channel for more.
and subscribe if you want to see more videos as we post them. Thanks for watching.